amazing. So what, uh, I don't know. I don't know what to say because all those which goes around the goal that but did not go in. So fantastic, really. And good. good both teams teams are good. I think we also were very, very lucky because we had like posed so many times and it was just so close all the time. So yeah. we were just lucky, and my heart was beating all the time. So yeah. I don't know. I think like normally they don't play that much long balls, but today it kind of worked, and they had just had the the luck on their side, and not only in the defense but also in the offense. So that was very good today. And, and we were so lucky in the beginning that the Austrians did not make the goal. So I think that was a game changer. If they would score the first one, I don't know how it ends. They were really good, so yes. And now you're through to the semi-finals. France or the Netherlands? Is there a team you would rather face? <laughs> I don't know. Both are good. Both are really good and challenged. So I, I hope the final is against England, so we, we survive the semis. But so it doesn't matter who is it going to be, it's just Germany's going to win it, that's all. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> uh, I think both are very strong teams, but I don't know, I would say maybe France will make it. Yeah, yeah. I guess so. France will make it. Oh, great. I love the stadium. That That's so cool to be in that small stadium and it was all the people here and so nice. And we, we had some, some locals around us where we had contact with, great, really. Yeah, I can only agree, it was very, very <laughs> much fun and I really enjoyed the atmosphere today, it was great. Yeah. Okay. Thank you very much. Yeah, welcome. <laughs> Thank you. Well, I actually thought it was going to be way better for Germany. I didn't expect Austria to be that good, actually. But they played 1-0 against England, so they're kind of good already. But yeah, super happy, uh, half final. Germany. Uh, it's going to be very hard against France or Netherlands, but we're very happy about it. And now we're going to celebrate. Not France. I think they're very good. Because a lot of our German players of our game are actually in, uh, lost against the French in the Champions League game against Lyon or Paris. So I'm kind of scared about that. But again, we've been doing so great so far. So I'm really hoping we're going to reach the final in Wembley. Maybe against England. <laughs> yeah, I am very positive about it. It would be very good for German uh, women's soccer or football. So I'm really hoping it's going to happen. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah? Because of the. Oh, yeah. I thought it was the Austrians were very loud. Um, but I was in the German corner, so I just heard German screaming. And we even had a drummer. So that was very cool. Uh, but every time the German fan club provides us with these flags, so that was very great. Yeah. Sure. Deutschland, 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 Deutschland. You see? <laughs> yeah, it does. Yes. Very proud of them. Well, I thought Germany played pretty good. At the start, I think the first half was more Austria's because they pressed pretty good, pretty fast. And, um, well, I think the goal was pretty good, well played. And, yeah, Germany just deserved it in the end. Where do you think they went right to Germany? So, in the second half, pressing, pressing for the ball, getting the ball in crucial places and then scoring um, the goal. Yeah. So I think I would prefer to um, play um, France because the Netherlands they won the last Euros so and uh, they have they have much quality. It's coming on. Um, France has, is pretty good as well, but I think just just better if if we play France, yeah. Maybe I hope it's going to be um, England versus Germany in the final, and we'll see. England is a pretty good side. So um, if England plays um, plays against Germany like they played um, against Spain, it it could be a Germany a German win. But yeah, England is pretty good, so maybe. So 
Yes, because I've been to men games, the atmosphere was better, but for women's football this was perfect atmosphere. It's changed over the years and the Germany fans are always loud when it comes to like cheering other players on, so that was perfect atmosphere today. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, it was a fantastic game. I think um, Germany was a more convincing uh, team, but I think both uh, both players were absolutely amazing. So but we were very glad we threw. So up to the semi-finals. No, I think it was a great game. I think everybody was very fair, and it was a lovely atmosphere in the stadium. So the best winner should always uh, go first. So. I think, I mean, France is always a super good player, and the Netherlands is always a bit of a touchy game with the Germans, but the best one should really go through, and then let's see what comes. And we hope. <laughs> that's, that's the plan, but yeah, no, I mean, we never know, so the best one should really go forward, and then let's see what happens. And then, of course, England is in the game as well, so it's very exciting for us. Thank you. Bye. I think Austria deserved something, if I'm honest. Yeah, yeah. yeah. the first the half, definitely, they deserved to score. And yeah, there were so definitely. many times where both teams hit the post. Mm. Yeah. It was a very good game. It was a very tight game, yeah. They I made think. a little mistake at the end. Yeah. That, that, that cost them the game. But yeah, really good atmosphere. They were worth the money. It looked really enjoyable. Yeah, it was nice. Yeah. Yeah, very good. Yeah. Yeah, brilliant. The brilliant, whole game. Yeah. Oh, sorry, I just knocked your mic off. <laughs> the whole game, brilliant atmosphere, wasn't it? Up on our feet, there's a couple of weeks ago. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was really, really good. Yeah. yeah. And we got a couple of souvenirs. Uh -huh. But I'm not taking that home. I think it's shown the women's football's come a long way, yeah, basically. 100%. It's catching yeah. up with the men's, definitely. Yeah. yeah. Everyone was joining in with the chance and everything, so. Yeah, and it was nice to see capacity. So, off to Wembley. <laughs> <laughs> Thank Bye. you. Uh, it would have been fantastic to win, but it is what it is. You know, Austria done fantastic in this tournament. Uh, we went to uh, Southampton to see them, great game. We went to Brighton to see them, fantastic game. Now I've been at home in Brentford, absolutely brilliant. Uh, Germany, uh, better, better side, I don't know. But they deserve to win. So, you know, it is what it is. You know, Austria made us proud. Uh, they done fantastic. The girls and everyone proud. Uh, you, uh, uh, European women's football, yeah, done everyone proud. It's fantastic, really, really good. Yeah. What did you make of the atmosphere? Yeah, it did. I mean, I don't know. Austria and Dad, growing up in England, I've always found that there's a bit of a rivalry between Austria and Germany, and I definitely felt it today. Like we were, we had a couple Germans sat behind us, and every time it was we kind of shouted, they'd be there like nine, nine, kind of behind us. Germany, yeah, see. It's coming out! It's coming out! It's coming out! It's coming out! See? Yeah, so I would say there is a bit of a rivalry between Austria and Germany. Yeah, they're not even German! Can't even speak German! Um, so, but it was, it was nice. It was fun. In a weird way, it was almost like a rugby match because the sides were mixed, which you don't normally get with, like, regular Brentford match. <laughs> so I I really enjoyed it. I thought it was great fun. It was it was nice, but I think Austria came out defensively. You know, if two teams come out not to lose, it's never a good game of football. I think Germany came out to win, Austria came out not to lose. So where all the other games, Austria came always out to win. So I think that went wrong. But when they played England for instance, you know, yes Austria lost one nil. But both teams came out to win, and that's always a recipe for great football. So today, I think that very defensively, uh, Nicole Bieler, wonderful striker, but she wasn't where she meant to be up front, get the balls, get the headers in, you know, like the goal she scored in, um, in Brighton against Norway. Fantastic goal. But it just wasn't there today. I think, I don't know, tactics wrong, tactics right, I don't know. But Germany, I think, wanted it a little bit more, so it is what it is, so, uh, you know. I think they will. I think it's going to be yeah. England, Germany in the final. And I think it's going to be a great, great final. And we can say we lost 1 0 against uh, uh, England, 2 0 against Germany. You know what? If they're in the final, you know, great for Austria. <laughs> Thank, you Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Cheers. Have a good night. Thank you. So, for the duration, what do you make of that game? 
I felt we came in here with high hopes and, and even the, the kind of first 15, 20 minutes, I'm sure we're the better team. But we just lost confidence after that first goal and we just didn't have the opportunity. I, I think luck didn't go away. We got our heads down and um, it's such a shame this was our opportunity. And t to lose to Germany as well just makes it even more painful. Atmosphere is incredible, actually. It was, you come to a place like this in, in West London, you've got no idea who's the home team. And um, it felt like the crowd could have been the home team of either team. It could have changed. But then towards the end, the flags came out and you're like, ah, oh, yeah, there's a lot more Germans here than Austrians. I, I, I think if we'd have scored early, the crowd could have come on our side. But um, yeah, not our night tonight. things of a German football team, you, you'd never write them off. They've, they've got the pedigree in, in, both, in both sports. They've got the experience of their league. And um, even if they were playing terribly, you'd still suspect they could win. But they're playing well right now, so they've got to be one of the favourites. Thank you very much. Thank you. Can you give us a cheer?